Yeah. District titles are on the line in Columbus Grove as our local teams compete for Aspire Regionals next week. Let's we'll start off with the boys' Division Three District One race. As the host school's very own Luke Elbrock out in front, this Bulldog senior claims gold with a time of 15 minutes, 45.96 seconds, and Columbus Grove also wins the team title with 24 points. Now it's a D3 District 2 race, and the NWC continues to be represented. As Lincoln View's Connor Baldoff grabs first place, he finishes in 16 minutes, 14.11 seconds. The Lancer team also wins the district championship with 31 points. And our final boys race is from Division 2, District 1. And we have OG's Ty Rosengarten bringing home the gold for the blue and gold with a new school record of 15 minutes, 47.19 seconds. Right behind him is Van Wert's Owen Scott, who claims second place, and his team also finished as a district runner-up. The ladies are up now in the girls' D3 District 1 race. It's a pack of Minster Lady Cats, Cheney Cedarleaf, Margaret Hemmelgaard, and Maria Niekamp comes in first, second, and third, respectively. And no surprise that the Minster girls team wins the team championship with 19 points. Then we have the girls' District 2 race. Brynlyn Moody adds a district title to her resume with a time of 19 minutes, 4.68 seconds. And the Lady Lancers also win the team crown with 39 points. And finally, in the girls' Division 2 District 1 race, we have Anna Buttemeyer and Madeline Hovis of OG coming in second and third, respectively. The OG Lady Titans secured the team championship with 32 points, along with a spot at regionals. And now we turn it over to Dylan Tyson with more district cross-country action. Tony, let's make our way over to Hancock County for another district meet from Owens Community College. We start with the boys in Division 1. Repping Allen County is Shawnee senior Noah Williams. With a time of 15 minutes and 59 seconds, he finishes third overall and leads his team to regionals. Right behind him in fifth is Finley's Adrian Steckschulte, who will qualify as an individual, and so does Axton Foshnoff from Wapak in ninth place. In D2 for the boys, the Liberty Benton Eagles showed out. Jackson Hochstetler finishes runner-up with 16 minutes and 45 seconds, leading his team to a dominant district championship. And now for the girls going back to Division 1, Finley sophomore Natalie Gutman leads the charge for the Trojans. Third place with 19 minutes and 49 seconds, and her team is heading to regionals. Right on her tail was Wapkineta freshman Kenzie Schneider in fourth place. She's headed to Tiffin as an individual qualifier. Lastly, the D2 girls. Jenna Stump for Shawnee takes seventh place after 19 minutes and 50 seconds. The Lady Indians are moving on to regionals, and so is Liberty Benton with Maddie Garkey in ninth. These athletes race on next Saturday in Tiffin.